It is hero worship, without a hero. What does that mean exactly? It means that there is a search to look at yourself, to see what you are and what you'd like to be. This is the realization that you can become more than what you are, better, improved, even superior. Are you ambitious or are you idle? There is an answer, and maybe you don't want to face the truth. I am always ducking the responsibility to be the me I want to achieve, at least temporarily, and then the necessity to make my dreams reality starts to overshadow me distinctly, and I crawl out from under the fears I covered myself with, to gather strength for my accomplishments. The renewal that fuels my methods is hidden in a vacuous subsistence, a dark subterranean cavern of mental limbo, if you will. I relinquish my clamoring chains and shed the disdain, so I can face the reflections directly, no longer avoiding the reality I have successfully sidestepped anonymously. The cloud cover has been swept away to reveal the shining star of morning, gloriously belting out exquisite bursts of radiation, visible light rays for warmth, and the joy is physically dropped upon shapes and forms from the fabulous heavenly body above. What is the goal? What direction do I move to attain the manifestation that minds birth? From the lengthy period of gestation there is a gift delivered appropriately into life definitively. I nourish it with sustenance, and the attention I transfer through energy's release increases the propensity for me to complete my intentions effectively. And yet the question remains, what exactly do I wish to attain? The defining of courses is coarse and grotesque, because you have to feel as if it is truly significant in order to justify rewarding yourself with the destination of your journey. The idea that it might just be silly, or subsequently someone else diminishes your desires disrespectfully, and you begin to second-guess the steps you've taken to cover the ground you've traveled accordingly. Now it is time to broaden your stance and persevere beyond the defiance and the disbelief you face adversely. Your determination is astoundingly resolute against such opposition. And now, fantasies are captured as easily as breathing. No longer reluctant to give glance and chance the expanse of imagination, you understand that you have always been the limitation, and your scrutinizing examinations have often exasperated your own expansion. So what do you want to be?